What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new trucking vlog. Today's video, we're gonna be taking Phase Rug and Simplistic on their very first trucking adventure. We're gonna show them what it's like to be a truck driver. We're gonna take them over to the very first truck stop. They've never been to one. That thing's kind of crazy. We're gonna show them the food in there. And then we're gonna cook inside the truck. We got some Japanese A5 Wagyu for them. And at the end, we're gonna make some deliveries, some really special, special deliveries. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video and let's get straight into it. Oh. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe because we're on the road to 2 million subscribers, guys. So please make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's get there. Vamanos! What's up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new trucking vlog. Today, I'm taking FaZe Rug What's and good? Noah <laughs> on their very first ever trucking adventure. Sure. And I'm going to show them what it's like to be a truck driver. Dude, we're so happy to be here. Appreciate mm. you guys coming, bro. For real. Hey, I appreciate course. you guys. I'm I appreciate excited, you bro. too, Noah. Michael, I appreciate you. He's the one doing all the heavy lifting. Yeah, yeah for bro, sure. We gotta give sure. him yeah, credit. We, yeah, for sure. For <laughs> sure. Okay, here we go. Let's go. First time ever drive. I, you know, I've never been in a truck like this. Ever, ever? Ever. And, bro, the cool thing, too, is. Oh! Wait, how high up? <laughs> it goes up high. Bro, look how high up I am now. And then it's like a car, too. Like it. What? <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm at an amusement like a low, park? Like a low rider. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, there are so many different knobs here. One, one of them that we don't want to press when we have a trailer is this one or this one. Does it detach them? It'll unhook it. Hey, 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 hey! <laughs> For one time too, bro, if that's it's really like crucial too when you back into your trailer, you got to hear this like little clink noise. The first time I did it, I wasn't paying attention to it and I thought I heard it and when I took off, the trailer just poof. It's fell on the floor. Wait, before you start driving, the booster seat, bro. Oh, what are you doing? Shit. Come on. You can't drive Damn. when you're that short, that's, that's bro. That's right. Fuck. Oh, can I see the booster seat, please? <laughs> oh. There we go. All right, now I feel safer. Now, now I can see over their steering wheel. <laughs> I always tell people too, bro, like, because I, I feel like um, everyone thinks that you have to do what is trending to, to get like. A following. I never thought truck driving would get me the subscribers I have on YouTube. You just got to find your 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 niche and it, it'll work out. And then add your own touch to that exactly. niche. You know? yes, exactly. Like, the way you did it was perfect, bro. You turned like normal truck driving to this. Yeah, which yeah. Is cool, See, bro. which is cool. And then it like like how I have the PlayStation back there, yeah, the Xbox, the generator. Like, like, it just like it, like it just gives it a whole different experience. That people because I feel like I'm sure you too. Like when you see a truck, it's just the truck. Yeah. Like now that you're in it, it's it's literally someone else's home. There's bro, there's people that will be in their truck for like 14 days to a month. That's why sometimes I'll say it's my it's my home on 18 wheels. Now it's like when I see a truck, I'm gonna be like, oh, what does it look on the inside? On the is inside, it yeah, it's always like, it's always a mystery too, man. So what is this mirror for? Like, does this actually help? Oh yeah, there's times where like if like if someone's in your blind spot, you, you can't see, and oh. that mirror will show them show you the. The blind spot. <laughs> Michael, you don't want the smoke, bro. Ooh. That was your Nintendo? Not the Nintendo. You know what's the 0 to 60 in this thing? 2.5? 1. 1.2. <laughs> million seconds. No. <laughs> Quick once it starts catching up at speed, but like, yeah. if I were to step on it right now, it doesn't look like it. Hey, you feel it pick up pretty fast, though. Hey, yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty quick. I'm are you guys Raiders Ooh. fans? Michael, tell them about the Niners. <laughs> oh, this is Rock 3. Let's play Oh, dang. Uh, those are fighting words, Noah. No, it is. I give you permission. No. I'm, I'm gonna <laughs> so, and, uh, something cool, too, about the truck. Say if we're going downhill, if I go down like this, it's called an engine brake. And if you're coming down super fast, I don't know if you've ever seen videos where like the bra the, the brakes will catch on fire. It's because they'll be holding down their brakes, but if they hold this down, Oh. The engine starts to break by itself. All right, guys. So right now we're on our way to Pilot Truck Stop. Now I'm gonna show Ryan and Noah the ins and outs of the truck stops, and we might get a slushy or two Dude, as well. Dude, we need a slushy. We, we have on. to. It's a must. Bro, I've never been to a truck stop in my entire life. Ever? Ever, bro. What the heck? Ever, ever bro. Not even when you're on the road and you're like stop to get a snack or anything like that. I've only stopped at gas stations, so really? I'm actually like really excited, bro. Their first time. At a truck stop. Dude, I've never seen this many trucks in I my didn't, life. I, he was telling me that he's never been to a truck stop. I, I don't know. No, have you been to a truck stop? Never in my life. Like, I had to come and bring them in and show them. I want to learn from the one and only right here. You know what I mean? 
you, you'll see where it says uh, welcome drivers. I'm gonna take my Tesla here after. <laughs> Dude, we gotta get some snacks. Um, Alex, you were saying this is where you shower? I shower here. Um, if if I if I really want to, I can wash my clothes here. The first time at this truck stop. Yeah, it's my first time at this truck stop, so I don't know exactly what they have in there. Whoa! Thank you, bro. Of course. See, okay, look it. This is where I tell you guys showers. Shower guest. Showers and laundry. And laundry right here. So. Oh wait, it, wait, did it just call out that a shower was free? Yeah, no, that it was ready. There's four showers available. You come in here. Everyone showering right now. Yes, it, bro, kind of smells like Old Spice. It smells good. Yeah. And then down here, look at, you got the laundry room. Whoa. You got a that's whole laundry sick. room right here. No, you want me to wash your clothes for you, bro? Yeah. I got you. <laughs> Dude, one rule always at gas stations, I know there's a truck stop, but I look for chug rug. Not mm -hmm. looking, it's not looking good here, bro. It's equivalent to a gas station, it just has extra stuff. Yes, extra stuff, yeah. anything that a truck driver might need. You guys hungry or should we save it for the Wagyu? I say we save it for the Wagyu, but we have to get a slushy. What's your favorite flavor? Coca-Cola? You're one of those? I, I don't like Coca-Cola. <laughs> favorite always since I was a kid was blue raspberry and red cherry mix. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Pretty good. It's good. It's not walk worthy though. It's not walk worthy. Got so how was how was your guys' first time going to a truck stop? What, what was what would what do you guys rate it? It was a five. I would rate it a nine point five out of ten. You know, I'm gonna have to go with a six because I did go to Bucky's before and that's the biggest Ooh. gas station in the world. Maybe, so maybe yeah. you need to try the world's largest truck stop. Where is that at? That's in Iowa. Are we going? If you're down, I'm down. Listen, I'm not opposed to it. I think we just have to convince. We gotta convince Brian. Yeah. To truck stop right now. Let's go, Brian. Here. I'm gonna book the tickets. No, to <laughs> Iowa. Bro, if I'm back here until we get to Iowa, I'm, I'm gonna die. Good. Maybe I should shake the truck a little bit. The truck? Yeah, like this. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So right now we're gonna go back, and I'm gonna show Face Rug and Noah Simplistic how we cook it up in the back of my truck. And we're gonna be making some Japanese A5 wagyu. Oh. So it's gonna be. It's gonna be. It's gonna be good. Maybe this might be face rug uh, walk worthy. I think it will be. You think so? Yeah, for sure. I hope for so. Wagyu. Wagyu has to be. A5 Japanese wagyu. I hope so. From Tokyo. Straight from Tokyo. If you guys had to guess how much a semi truck fills up with, how what would you guys guess? Wait, okay, keep in mind. Wait, hold on, buddy. Don't tell them because I know you know. Wait. This specific semi truck has two 150 gallon tanks. Two. Oh two. So okay, 300 gallon. 300 guess. gallons. So all the way up. All the way up. I have my guess. I I'm gonna guess two. 650. What do you was, guess? I was gonna do 450. Ooh, that, that's on that. That would be heaven for truck drivers. What? What? Yep. Like easily a thousand dollars. Wait, and how often do you have to fill like up? Like three days. Every three days? Two days, depends on how far you drive. And you gotta keep in mind, you gotta do the reefer as well. Reefer also takes diesel, and that's that's like 300 bucks, maybe like 200 bucks. So like all together, that's why a lot of truck drivers, when when the prices started going up, they started stressing out because they were, they were going from paying 600, $700 to fill up, to paying 12, $1,400. Hey, just up. know I'm gonna take care of the gas for you driving down here. I'll nah, you're good, bro. I appreciate no, it. No, 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 no. That's what I'm gonna do. Any like companies that take care of it for their drivers? Or? Yeah. So my my uncle, he has he has an actual like diesel tank at the yard. Oh. So I never go to a truck stop to fuel up. We have it at the at our yard. Oh. Yeah. Most companies, if if you work for someone, they're gonna take care of it. Do they offer like membership? Uh, they'll give you free showers. Free showers. Free drinks. Yeah. All right, guys. Now I'm gonna show. Face Rug, aka Brian, aka Face Rug. How how we cook it up in the back of the of the truck, bro? That looks amazing. Look at that. Ooh, ooh, the best sound possible, bro. And it has to sound like that, or else to fail, bro. Yeah. <laughs> A5 Wagyu, like you didn't have to. Bro, I had to, man. <laughs> had to. No, you're really taking care of me today. We're gonna season it with, it's just some pepper. Oh, baby, that's all you need to get the flavor of the Wagyu. That's the, that's the perfect thing about this Wagyu. It's, it cooks quick and you don't need to season it that much. All exactly. you gotta do is some pepper and, and you're chewing. Brown on the other side. This one right here. Oh yeah. It reminds me of brisket. 
Yeah, you know yeah. Thin brisket from Korean barbecue. Yes, literally. That's I exactly. love brisket. Bro. So how often do you be cooking back here? Whenever I'm in the truck, I ha I have to at least cook something up for sure. Nice. Even if it's just some, I have like I have some ramen up there. Oh yeah. I'll cook some some spicy noodles. Bro, bulldog ramen. You something yeah, wrong. something quick. That's why this thing is perfect because I just put the water in there, it boils it, and then I throw it on here and then. Hell yeah. Do you ever put egg in your ramen? Yeah. Bro, that's, uh, bro, so, that's good. so good. But the only thing that sucks about this is that if you eat too much, you're gonna be sick. Yeah, because of because of how like fatty it is side. A little crispy. Gotta get is it. Is that ready? Oh, let's go. That's ready right there. Dude, yeah, it produces so much oil. Honestly, this stuff, I I think I see my guy, well, I wanna say, eat it even sick. raw. What? Just, Just kidding, <laughs> that is not smooth for me. <laughs> Michael, you want another piece, buddy? You're Crazy. That's probably the hardest one. Okay, you ready? Cheers, guys. Cheers. 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 Cheers to the truck life. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> that was freaking delicious. 10 out of 10. What do you rate? 10 out of 10. 10. What do you rate it, buddy? 8. Eight. I'm just kidding, 10. Yeah, yeah. Where's Noah? No, look at Noah's back. still over there walking. Noah! You rate the wagyu. What do I rate it? Yeah. Is it five stars? 10 out of 10. All right, guys, now we're going to head over to Target and we're going to do a little bit of giving back. And we're going to see what we can find and what we can do. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at the closest Target near me, please. Made it to Target. It's time to give back. Let's do it. Best thing about this, giving back to the community. As a truck driver, do you like giving back? I love giving back. Can you get it, bro? I always, I always try to do it. Good karma always comes back your way. Michael was saying that I should join the mullet gang. Alex, <laughs> Michael, it, Sherman. Phase rug, mullet rug. Mullet, mullet rug. rug. Left phase, join mullet. Hi, uh, can we grab a Nintendo Switch, please? I don't know. This, this one? This is the uh, O-ring. Okay. And then three. You know what would be good? Hats. I think like a Lego set. Yeah. That would be really that's good. That's what I was thinking. Nice Lego set. We'll let you pick, Michael. You know all the good Legos. Huh? Oh, yeah. Hey. Top it off with a PS5. Yep. What do you think, Alex? I think, I, I mean, I, th I think someone will yep. be really happy with a PS5 yep. for sure. Spider-Man PS5. Ooh. Because oh, yeah. we just got a Spider-Man bike. Yep. Yep. Ooh, that's Spider-Man I like that. I think we're going to make some people's I, days yeah, for sure. sure bro. Thank you for the help. I want to give you the $200 gift card. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for being so nice. I appreciate Thank you. it. You've given away something. Michael's given something away. So you got to choose the next person to give that okay, away. Okay, to. okay, okay, perfect. Outside though, right? Outside, outside. He's wearing a Minecraft shirt. Oh, oh yeah. For the Lego set. Yeah. Should we give it to him? I think that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Do you like Minecraft? We got you a Minecraft Lego set. Let's go. <laughs> what about? That family right over there. Oh yeah, that's perfect. The coolest things about doing all this was just seeing the joy on everyone's faces whenever we would give them something. So part of this trucking adventure that we did right here was to make deliveries. And since we didn't have a trailer, we had to resort to doing this. And I mean, we still made deliveries at the end of the day. We just did it in our own way. Um, but it was still a really cool experience. And this was probably one of my favorite parts right here. Hey guys, so we've been doing some shopping around and we wanted to give away this bike to you guys. We, we, the first kids we seen, we wanted to gift them a bike. A little so. Spider Man bike. The bike. You like Spider Man? Yeah. yeah. That's perfect. That's even better. Yeah. That's for you guys. Yeah, that's for you far. guys. Appreciate yeah. it. Yeah, 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 I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Hope you guys have a great day. Yeah. Appreciate yeah. it. Of course, no worries. We have a surprise now for Michael. We got him a few gifts because heard he's a huge fan. Alex drove all the way down here. A brand new gaming chair. And let's just say we got $500 worth of V-Bucks. Oh, I have something for you guys, okay? You like seeing you your kid happy, it. right? Yeah. That's that's your drive every day, every day your motivation. Every day. What do you mean by that? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean by that? We want to give you a brand new gaming chair. Oh. That's yours. That's perfect for your, for your PC that you just got, buddy. And I got one more thing. So he was asking for something inside Target that I couldn't get him, but I already had them bought. Here's Why so much? <laughs> These are all your V bucks, bro. All your V bucks. Yup. Yeah, yeah. yep. oh. Let's go. Oh. Thank you, guys. Of course, of course. Give me a hug. And thank you too, bro, for making my kids day. It makes me happy. That's, like, a, that's getting, what I do. I'm getting for. emotional right now, bro. But like, yeah. Like for real, dude. Like, 
You made his day. Really, I really wanted to that's, see that's worth it. That's worth everything in, in my book. Bro. I appreciate you, bro. Nah, thank you for real for just showing me like a day in your life and you know, taking me in your truck. Doing all the stuff that we did today was so much fun. Yeah, like it it's rough. it's a day that I won't forget. It's gonna be a day he remembers forever too. Hey. That's why I say thank you. Bro. Yeah, of course, man. That's something he's never gonna forget. And Dude, there's, there's still stuff that I remember when he was that young. Thank you, bro. Of course, bro. Of course. The road of life.